Yo! Ah! I don't know what to do with my hands. Guys, I just went and checked the mailbox, and I have stumbled upon probably one of the coolest boxes of Pokemon thing I may have ever seen. This is an exclusive Pokemon 25th anniversary package straight from the Pokemon company. Thank you so much, Pokemon, for sending this. I am so excited to see what is inside here, and I wanted to take y'all on this journey with me. So this is the super duper sleek 25th anniversary logo. Pokemon Day, the actual anniversary, is on February 27th. That is a Saturday, Pokemon Day. So in addition to taking a look at what is inside this, one of you guys also, oh, uh, <coughs> lift with the legs. <laughs> one of you guys also sent this gigantic box. This is really heavy. It's very large. It is about the size of me. And we're gonna investigate whatever's inside of this as well. Buckle up, it's gonna be a wild ride. <laughs> Why am I weird? <laughs> but first order of business is the Pikachu box in question. This is a very special box and I am so honored to have been sent it. So thank you so much, Pokemon. But let's go ahead and get into it. <laughs> oh my goodness. There's a little Pikachu right here on a music note. Oh my goodness. Look at how cute that is. He's so handsome. Oh, hello. All right. Eh. So inside of this Poke package, <laughs> we've got some exclusive Pokemon 25th anniversary merch right here. Oh man, hold on. Oh, this is sick. Yo, check it out. So as you know, Pokemon is hosting a concert this weekend for the Pokemon 25th anniversary. They've got Post Malone. I don't know if Katy Perry is in on this one as well, but they've got some large artists doing a concert this weekend and they made merch for the thing. You've got Pikachu with a vinyl record. You've also got little Thunderbolts all along the bottom there. This is a pretty dope design. They really decked it out with Pikachu, but we've got the hoodie. We've also got <laughs> the regular t-shirt. I love this so much, dude. Wow. Oh, and there's a, hold on. There's a note in here. I should read the note for, how rude of me. I should read the note first. You got a little Pikachu on the top right there. <clears throat> It's not just a birthday. This is a celebration of 25 years of Pokemon fun and the fans that make it possible. Celebrate with us on Pokemon Day, February 27th at 7 p.m. Eastern time on YouTube and Twitch for a virtual concert with a special musical guest and some of our most iconic Pokemon. We might not be together live, but you can still flex your festival style with this collection of 25th anniversary gear. Dude, this is, this is so freaking cool. Oh man. Get ready with your new look and we'll see you on Pokemon Day from Team Pokemon. This is dope. I'm gonna be flexing the, oh my god, we're gonna be, we're gonna be raving at that concert on Saturday. Don't mind me. Yee. Yeah. I'm gonna put this on. Oh god. Woohoo. Don't mind me. My brand new P25 merch. Oh man, it doesn't stop there. There's another thing in here. We've got a, a poster. There is so much Pikachu on this. I gotta find a place to hang this. This is incredible. So the whole poster right there at the bottom, you've got the uh, celebrating 25 years. You got the little lightning bolts once again. I love their incorporation of the vinyl records with the freaking Pokeball inside. You see that? That is artistic choice. Once again, this is a massive Pokemon celebration this year, and I'm so happy to be included in any part of it, but I will for sure be tuning into the concert this Saturday. I'll see you in the live stream. So that is going to be super exciting. Now moving on to the other gigantic box sitting on my floor. You should have seen me walking out of the post office with this. It was, I, actually almost full transparency i actually almost dropped it <laughs> but we've made it this is from joseph you hear that crunch oh my gosh are you serious hold on i'm gonna freaking pass out joseph oh you didn't have to do this man <laughs> you guys <laughs> I'm gonna lose, okay, this is this box is full, first off, full to the brim. I'm gonna lose my freaking mind. Uh, we've been talking about this for quite some time on the podcasts, on my streams, on whatever. I haven't been able to find the Sword and Shield Ultra Premium Collection box anywhere. Joseph literally sent us the whole freaking box in the mail. This is a hefty one, 16 packs in one box. Is it getting hot in here? Whew. 
Hi Danny, how's it going? This box is a compilation of goodness. I figured it'd be great for the show during holidays, which as a recent subscriber, I'm finding very interesting to get used to. <laughs> Me? You know what? Uh, welcome. Thank you for supporting the channel. I hope you stick around. I hope I don't do too much weird to make you go gone. <laughs> that you, um, you had, you, you, you could, you do. Nonetheless, I hope everything's been great for you. Continue to have fun for the Poke anniversary this year. Be blessed always. Happy New Year. Thank you so much, Joseph. <laughs> what? A little growly. Oh, this is so precious. This is a Pokemon clip and go. Oh my gosh. Pokeball belt set. Things I didn't know I needed, especially as a grown adult. No, I need it. I definitely need it. I can wear this around. You're telling me I can clip a Growlithe to my belt and carry it with me everywhere? I'm sold. <laughs> Literally sold. That's so funny. Look at little homie on the back. Look at little homie on the back. What a flat. You imagine you walk onto the playground and you got this belt on? Stunting all your fresh new mods. Oh, you are gonna be the coolest kid in school. That's freaking bananas. Stay tuned. This is going somewhere. I don't know where it is. TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, somewhere. I will be wearing this. Oh man, you really did not have to do this, dude. We've got a Vivid Voltage Elite Trainer Box. I don't even know where you find one of these right now. I haven't seen Pokemon products in 84 years. <laughs> I literally, like, it's so hard to find cards now. I am actually geeking out right now because not only do we have an entire sealed Vivid Voltage Elite Trainer Box, but we also have a double V Champion's Path Box and part of a McDonald's Happy Meal? Part of a McDonald's Happy Meal? The little... Pikachu's cute little face and a small but mighty premium collection box. This is so freaking cute and so hard to find. I can't believe I'm getting so geeked over. I mean, I, I can believe I'm getting so geeked over Pokemon because this is it. This is it. This is the box that separates the boys from the men <laughs> or the cutie patooties from the not so cutie patooties. This is absolutely incredible. Joseph, homie, thank you so much. I don't, I don't know. I, I'm so excited to crack into these products. Seriously, thank you so much. There's still more. But wait, there's more. I gotta show, there's a couple more things. Is this, hold on. We've got some Happy Meal toys. Not one, not two, but three, four, five, six Happy Meal toys? Ah! Oh! Okay, once again, I am overwhelmed by the cuteness from this box here. This is the McDonald's Happy Meal box, just like condensed. Uh, we'll go ahead and take a look at the wide array of toys that we have here today once again. But I figured we'd go ahead and get some glamour shots of all of these products. Look at this, the freaking soup. This is a crazy box. It's so, it is very heavy. This is definitely what was weighing down that actual package. Once again, I actually almost dropped it, but we're trying our best, yeah. So stay tuned, future video will definitely be cracking into the Sword and Shield Ultimate Ultra premium collection. Once again, Vivid Voltage Elite Trainer Box. It has been <laughs> quite some time since I've opened Vivid Voltage and this set is not old. It's just really, I don't know what's going on. I can't find it at the stores, but I think we're gonna save this for a live stream. So we'll probably unbox that live on one of our world famous Super Duper Danny live streams. We are gonna unbox the Double V Champions Path Box today. And we'll take a look at these McDonald's toys. So once again, you guys can get these Still at McDonald's. If you want to go to McDonald's, ask them for their Pokemon Happy Meal. For toy number one, you do get a deck box. And this is so cute. Oh, we got the Kanto one. So in the past, we had gotten, I believe it was Johto and Hoenn. And now we've got Kanto. I don't know if they did it for literally every single gen, but this is cute. So these Pokemon vary even with the toy number itself being the same. So this is toy number one. We happen to get gen one. And now we can go ahead and store any of our extra cards that we get, or I guess the cards in general that we get out of our pack in this bad boy right here. You've also got a little puzzle in there, like a little maze, which is pretty cute. We'll do toy number two next. This one is blue. It doesn't have anything written on this side. I actually don't even know what's in this one. Oh, <gasps> is this one of the sticker ones? Hold up, hold up. Oh, ah! 
we gotta tone it down here. Let's just take it easy, ladies and gentlemen. This is the sticker book, and you get to put your stickers all over the little Pokemon scenery. This is actually really freaking cute. I'm a big fan of stickers, so I will be sticking those on things. Oh, this one's the picture frame. So we've got, once again, another pack. You do get a pack in every single one of these McDonald's Happy Meals. And we've also got a little picture frame to store one of our cards in. So it little, it pops out like that. And then you just put a trading card, slide a trading card right in there. It's actually pretty dope. Oh, set it up on your desk. Like, instead of having like a picture of your family or something at the office, just have a picture of a nice little Pokemon card in there. All right, let's see what's in these packs. And then we will open up the Dub Wool box. It's gonna be a lot of packs for today. I'm hoping for that Pikachu. We haven't gotten the McDonald's Pikachu yet, but regardless, oh, there's a Snivy. Regardless, I still have quite a few cards from this set that I need to complete it. So we've got a Snivy right there, a Charmander, Chikorita, and a Totodile. Oh my goodness. So the Snivy is the holographic of this pack. Once again, you get three regular, not regular rares, just like regular promos. They all have this special promo stamp, but only one of them is holographic. And there is one card for every single starter. I should say one artwork for every single starter Pokemon, but they come in both holographic and in regular. So double trouble. There's, I guess, technically 50 different Pokemon cards to collect, even though the set is out of 25. You have a hollow and the regular. Okay, I'm gonna try to open it so that we can't see which card it is right here. I'm gonna flip it to the back. We're, doing, we're even doing the card trick on these. Once again, we want to get that Pikachu real quick. Or... Or the uh, Bulbasaur. The Bulbasaur is adorable. We got a Froakie, a Poplio, an Oshawott. Oh, and a little Rowlet. <gasps> oh, it's so precious. I love this. We got two grass types right here. Can we go three for three? We'll see what happens out of this last one right here. Okay, last pack right here. We got another Froakie. It's the second Froakie Wokey of the video. We got a Tepig. An Oshawott and a Chimchar. <gasps> this one, guys, look at the cute little face on this guy. That's ridiculous. This is great. Thank you so much, Joseph, for sending these Happy Meal toys along with these cool packs to open up in a video. Thank you, thank you. But it is go time. It is shiny Charizard time. Let's see if we can get that Charizard VMAX or really just any kind of super cool ultra rare out of Champion's Path. Hey, yo, Champ in the make. I was gonna say Champ in the making, but... Yeah, I'm okay. Everything's good. Oh, I'm a mess. She's a mess. Here we go. Four packs right here. These feel very dense. I am super excited to crack into those. We've got Dubwool and Dubwool Sun, aka Baby Dubwool. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. But we have opened these boxes on the channel before, so hopefully you guys have seen the Dubwool V. Very cool card. We'll go ahead and set this off to the side. We'll go ahead and get into these packs. I am going to save. Yeah, you know, I feel like this Al Clammy is actually the thickest pack of the day, so we are going to save that one for last. It's already at the end, so we're in perfect order here. All right. Wish us luck, guys. Wish us luck. Shout out to the notification squad also for getting here lickety split and snagging that code. I know it's going to be gone. It always happens this way. Like literally like 30 seconds after the video goes up, those codes are just gone. They're gone, I tell you. Here we go. We got a Sonya, a Sharpedo, Arbok, a Shabak, Linoon, Scraggy, Roly Coley. We got a Nicket, an Ekans, a Lipard, and a Zygarde. So we got a Zygarde holographic. Once again, the Champion's Path set does give you a hollow in every single pack. So nothing to write home about. Honestly, those hollows are, uh, I mean, there's only a set few of them. So we were more looking for the ultra rares, etc. And of course, that Charizard chase card. I have yet to pull it from Champion's Path. We have had some great luck with Shiny Star V and Shining Fates. So if you missed any of our streams or any of our videos on that, I'd highly recommend you check them out, especially the recent ones, because we've gotten some absolute slappers. I can't believe I used the phrase absolute slapper in a sentence and it was like a serious, you know, it was a serious statement I was making. We're going to move past it. We are going to just move past that. Suspicious food tin. I'm highly suspicious. We got a great ball here. Ekans. I see a Swablu in our future, an Inke, or in our present, I guess. Hatena, we've got a Kakuna, we've got a Sharpedo, and a Gardevoir VMAX. Oh, wow. 
That is gorgeous. I was gonna zoom, it's already pretty zoom. Oh my gosh, look at how close. This is aggressively close. Why would I ever need to get this close on my card? Wow, I this card is gorgeous. This is a stunning, a stunning, stunning Gardevoir card. Centering on it looks solid. I uh, can't complain about that. This is a brand new one for my collection. I actually do not have the Gardevoir VMAX from this set yet. So awesome. That is a fantastic pull right there. Honestly, that was enough for me. I really don't have very many of the VMAXs from this set, but I haven't opened a tremendous amount of this set in particular. So this is kind of nice. This is gonna help me complete my set. So thank you, Joseph. All right, got a drill right there. We've also got a a Milo. What's up, Milo? We got a Pokeball, a Carvana, Ekans, little, 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 little line. We got a Sharpedo. Did we get a Sharpedo reverse before? Am I tripping? Maybe it wasn't a Sharpedo. I think I'm actually losing my my marbles once again. We've got a Lycanroc holographic right there. All right, once again, hollow in every pack makes it not as whelming to get a hollow. Is that even a thing that I can say? Is that a phrase? Not as whelming. All right, last one right here. Let's go ahead and see what we've got out of the pack that I predicted personally to have the best card of the opening. We'll see if it pays off right here, right now. Love that. We've got a Milo. Hold on one second. I gotta make it. Okay, there we go. That's okay. I, I like have a pet peeve where if it's too bright and you can't see some of the, the details, it like ah, bugs me. Anyway, Trubbish, Potion, Line Noon, a Nicket, oh, that's a nice one. That energy reverse and a Machamp. Oh my God, I have not missed that Machamp, I have to say. I have missed the sparkly, warkly energy reverses. Guys, that was a great box. Out of the four packs, we did get the Gardevoir VMAX, as well as a reverse energy right there. And then once again, we got the three hollows out of the other three packs. That is stunning, ladies and gentlemen. So out of all of these fun things that we just cracked into, I am very pleased with the polls that we've gotten from even our McDonald's promo thingies, that Chimchar. That Chimchar, I think, is the most adorable of the McDonald's ones. And then obviously that God of War VMAX is crazy right there. So hope you guys enjoyed this opening. I hope you guys are excited for the 25th anniversary. Once again, this thing is so cool. I will be holding on to this box like forever. I freaking love it. So guys, once again, Pokemon concert this weekend, February 27th at 7 p.m. Eastern time. That is Pokemon day. So I hope you guys are celebrating doing something fun. We're probably gonna plan a live stream that day as we do every single Saturday as well as Sunday. But yeah, tune into the concert. Stay tuned for more information about more Pokemon 25th anniversary exciting things going down because there is so much that the Pokemon company has planned, I'm sure, and so much that we've already heard about so i'm really excited to see what comes next but once again thank you so much pokemon for sending this p25 music merch and thank you so much joseph for the awesome poke package i am overwhelmed by your guys's generosity so i hope you guys are having a great day and continue to have a great day and we'll see you guys next time bye